I am Krishna Bhaspe, returning officer for Karnataka North East Graduate Constituency Elections. As we know that for this election, the voting process is different from the usual Lok Sabha election. Like total, we have 19 candidates, and you have to mention your preference against each candidate. Your preference number one, two, three, four, and etc. So this will be the accepted ballot. You can see preference number one has been marked in English number. Two in Canada, three again in English. This ballot paper is also will, will be treated as invalid ballot and will not be taken up for the counting. This video presented by Al Sharay PU College for Boys and Girls, MSK Mill Road. Al Sharay PU College for Girl at Muslim Chowk, Bijgori, Gulbarga Girls PU College, opposite Makkah Masjid, Basveshwar Colony. Al Sharay BSc Degree College for Girls, Yadula Colony, and Al Sharay Public School powered by Lead, Old Jevargi Road. Admission are open contact for details. The elections to the Legislative Council from Karnataka North East Graduate Constituency is scheduled on 3rd June. Dear voters, as we know that for this election, the voting process is different from the usual Lok Sabha election. Here, the ballot paper will be provided to each voter and the voting will be on the preference base. Like total, we have 19 candidates and you have to mention your preference against each candidate. So, I will explain you with few cases what would be the valid uh, uh, vote and which in which cases the vote will be invalid. It is very necessary that your vote should be valid, then only it will be taken up in the counting process, otherwise it will be rejected as an invalid ballot paper. So I will give you, with, explain you the entire thing with few cases. So this is the very uh, first case. This ballot paper is accepted. Here, as a preference, we have marked the number like the kind of preference number 1, 2, 3, 4 and it's over. So this will be the accepted ballot. Here you have to uh, notice this thing that though I, we have total number of 19 candidates but you can mark up to uh, 1, 2, 3, 4 or whichever number you, you want to mark. You need not to mark all the 19 preferences. Similarly, in the Roman number you have marked the preferences, this is the correct ballot, it will be, uh, it is a valid ballot, it will be accepted. Similarly in the Canada language also you can mention your preference in the ballot paper, this ballot paper is perfect and a valid ballot paper. Now I will come to the cases whether the ballot paper during the counting will be treated as invalid ballot paper. So I will take up few cases one by one. Case number one. Here the preference has been started by two. First preference has not been given. In this case this ballot paper will be treated as invalid during the counting process. Case number two. Here ballot paper, the tick mark and cross mark has been mentioned against the candidate. So this is not a preference, this only tick and cross has been mentioned. This ballot paper will be also treated as invalid ballot paper and will not be taken up in the counting process. Case number 3. Here instead of using English uh, number or Roman number or, the, or Canada uh, number, the person has written ONE1, TWO2, THRWE3. So this is also not allowed by marking your preference in the ballot paper. This ballot paper will also be treated as invalid and will not be taken up for the counting. Case number 4. Here the voter has marked few preferences in English numbers and few preferences in Canada number. You can see preference number 1 has been marked in English number, 2 in Canada, 3 again in English and 4 in again in uh, Canada. This ballot paper is also will, will be treated as invalid ballot and will not be taken up for the counting. Case number 5. Here the candidate has marked with the English number, he has also written the number, like for 1 he has written ONE1, for 2 
ये रिटर्न टी डब्ल्यू ओ टू फॉर थ्री ये रिटर्न टी एच आर डबल ई थ्री दिस बैलेट पेपर इज ऑल्सो इन वैलिड बैलेट पेपर एंड विल नॉट बी टेकन अप फॉर द काउंटिंग केस नंबर सिक्स द वोटर हैज मार्क दिस प्रिफरेंसेस बट ही हैज ऑल्सो मार्क फ्यू लाइन्स Like between first and second, he is given some dash or line or some other thing. This case also the ballot paper will be invalid. Case number seven. Here the voter has marked yes, no, yes, no, no, yes against the candidate. This ballot paper is also invalid. Case number seven is a special case where the voter has marked his first preference and then after that he has marked his second preference for two candidates. In this case, the first preference will be counted and after that the ballot paper will be exhausted and during the transfer of vote to other candidate, this ballot paper will not be used. So these are the two examples where. The ballot paper will be taken as invalid ballot paper. It will not be considered for the further process. Again, I am saying these three ballot papers. They are best way of marking has been done in these three ballot papers, and they are accepted. English numbers for the clean proper marking, and it will be a valid ballot paper, and it will be accepted. Similarly. In the Roman or in the Roman numbers, the first, second, third, and fourth options have been given by the candidate. It is perfect. Similarly, in the Canada, the uh, first, second, third, fourth, fourth have been mentioned by the candidate, and it is a valid ballot paper. So, we, uh, these three cases, other than these three cases, all other ballot paper are invalid and will be rejected due to different reasons. Thank you. This video presented by Al Sharay PU College for Boys and Girls, MSK Mill Road, Al Sharay PU College for Girl at Muslim Chowk, Bijgori, Gulbarga Girls PU College, opposite Makkah Masjid, Basveshwar Colony, Al Sharay BSc Degree College for Girls, Yadula Colony, and Al Sharay Public School powered by Lead, Old Jewelry Road. Admission are open. Contact for details.